welcome back to my channel or if you're new here hello my name is Sam today I filmed this kind of festival inspired look using some new products from BH Cosmetics sorry I haven't been putting out a lot of content lately as you know I've been on vacation and then right after that was my birthday and my boyfriend's birthday and I've had family in town and just a lot going on but I am back to filming videos and making more looks for Instagram so if you stuck around, thank you. So yeah, you guys, if you want to see how I created this look, just keep watching. All right, guys, so I've already primed my eyelids with some concealer, um, and we're just going to jump right into this video. Today, I'm going to be testing out the Weekend Festival Palette from BH Cosmetics. I literally just got this today in the mail, and it came with this, some new brushes that I'll be trying out today, and some really cool little liquid eyeshadows and I'm very excited to be trying those as well. I'm going to start with this orange shade called Hippie and I'm going to place this right in my crease. I'm using this number six brush from their weekend festival brush kit and I usually really like their brushes. They're pretty good. So I'm just placing this in my crease. It's a little more red than I expected rather than orange. But we're just going to slowly blend it out. Next, I'm going to take the shade Escape, and I zoomed you guys in a little bit because I wasn't sure if you could see good enough. So I'm going to place this in the crease as well and smoke it out. I'm going to switch over to the number 7 brush, and I'm going to continue using that shade Escape. And I'm going to pack this in the outer portion of my eyelid. Then I'm just going to blend out the edge a little bit. I accidentally took that shade a little too far in, but it's totally fine. We're just going to go over the top with this eye lights. I think that's what these are called. They're basically liquid eyeshadows that dry down matte, and I'm such a huge fan of these. I, I'm so glad they've become really popular. This one is in the shade Gal Pal. I'm going to take this all in my inner corner. And I'm going to slowly bring it this way. Kind of making like a cut crease type of shape. I'm just taking my finger and kind of patting out the edges a little bit. To help this blend in more with the rest of my eyeshadow, I'm just taking a little bit more of that escape color. And I'm going to slowly bring it in and kind of just patting over the edge where the two meet. For just a little more of a pop, I'm going to go in with the shade called Fresh. And I'm going to keep this right in my inner corner. And then I'm going to tap it out a little. I'm going to go ahead and do my under eye area uh, before the rest of my makeup. Just so I don't have to deal with any kind of fallout. So right now, I'm taking my e.l.f. Beauty Shield. Oop, that was the back. My e.l.f. Beauty Shield. Um primer so I like to prime that area and then I'm going in with my concealer under my eyes blend that out with my beauty blender so we're not going to set the concealer we're just making sure there's no creases and I'm going to take the shade Palooza I'm going to use the number eight brush this is like a little pencil kind of brush and I'm just going to take this under the eye Kind of just laying it down first before we work on blending it all out. I'm just working on really smoking it out. I'm almost taking this a little bit lower than I normally would. I'm going to spray that same brush with some Fix Plus. And I'm going to go in with the shade Ultimate. And I'm just going to take that in my inner corner area. And next I'm going to take this really pretty teal highlights in the shade Gnarly. I'm just going to take this all under my eye and I'm going to use my finger to pat it out. I'm going to go in with the shade Hipster and use this number 9 brush. This is a little angled eyeliner brush because I just decided I wanted a little bit of eyeliner but nothing too harsh. So I'm just going to take this along my lash line in the outer corner. And now I'm going to take a little bit of the shade Trance back on that number 8 brush. And I just want this a little bit in my outer 
corner. I'm going to quickly do my face off camera and I will be right back to finish this look off with you guys. So I completely got like carried away and finished my face makeup. Um, but I still have to do my lips and I was thinking we could add some freckles since I got mascara here and it kind of looks cute. I think this look needs freckles. So I'm going to do that first. As per usual, I'm going to be using my Milani Brow Tint Pen in Natural Taupe. And I'm just going to put dots all over my face. And just for the heck of it, I'm going to do a couple dark dots. And I'm using my Ico I Do Liquid Eyeliner. This is a mini one that I got. But their eyeliners are one of my favorites. They're really, really good. To finish off this look, I'm going to line my lips with Max Oak Lip Pencil. And then I'm going to go in with Marmalade. This is a plushie from Lime Crime. It's my all-time favorite. Alright guys, well I think this is my finished look. I'm super happy with how this turned out. I think it's very, like, festival-y, but also... Uh, I totally would wear this look out. Since this was my first time using this palette and these little liquid eyeshadows from BH Cosmetics, I just wanted to go ahead and let you guys know that I really love these. Uh, I was super impressed. I, will, I always am impressed with BH Cosmetics because they're so cheap, but like, I don't know, they're, everything is just really, really good. There's not really anything I dislike from them. But yeah, this palette was really good and really pigmented. I barely had any fallout. Like, the only fallout I had was a little bit from this blue. And also these eye lights, which I'm probably never going to remember that name. It just sounds really weird to me. But these were so good and easy to use and obviously super pigmented. And the colors that they have out are really good. Also, the brushes that I used worked really well as well. Um, thumbs up. I'm impressed. I really, really like this collection. I do have a discount code with BH Cosmetics I just found out the other day. And I will have it either right here or in the description below if you're interested. Um, yeah, I think that's all I have to say. So if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, you can check out my Instagram. I'll have it on the screen right here. And let me know if there's any other looks you want me to film. And yeah, I guess I will see you guys next time. Bye!